Anyway, so if you will remember at the very end of last time, we finally made our way with, we sent a dubout into space. They, they found the orbit of Groellen. I don't know if I can change that name. I don't think so. Um, found the orbit of Groellen and we dumped out a little rover. I can't name him, which is a bit sad. I would have given him a cool name. But yeah, we have a little rover and we're just getting him to to scout out this place. It's a table. Seeing if there's like anything worth looking at. I can rummage there. Ah, uh, but the robot can't rummage. Sag. Uh, what do I need for this? Sedimentary rock. And what do I have? There's a lot of... Uh, oh, this igneous rock, perhaps. Igneous. Okay, we'll make it out of igneous. Oh, no, we won't. I have none. Oh, no, I do have it. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Just had to... Had to kick in a bit. Is this igneous too? It's dirt. Igneous, igneous. Okay, that's going to be the main one here, I guess. It's a little bit annoying building the same structures in different worlds because when I build something and make it out of igneous, the next time I try to build this in a different world that might not have that much igneous, it's going to say, hey, you want to make that out of igneous again? Yeah. <laughs> How cool is this guy? This bleach stone right there. Hell yeah. I love him already. Guess the song? Uh, I don't know that song. Or maybe I do, I don't know. Ah yes, we're getting more oil. Looks like it's coming in. It's coming in. Very nice. I don't know if I should mop this all up and then... Maybe put... One of these? Ay, uh, I gotta... Uh, I'm tempted to just remap those buttons because the amount of times I press... The wrong one. Oy. Oh, Billy Jean. Okay, I know that song. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. What? Oh, hell. That was not there. That was not there before. Thankfully, I think it got liquid locked. Uh, uh, no, it did not. <laughs> it did not get liquid locked. Oh no. Oh no. Mm hmm. Uh, dumb. So. Inhibited by gas. Killed by solid liquid. Well, how is it surviving in crude oil then? Oh, it survives in crude oil. Does it survive in carbon dioxide? Yes. Does it survive? Yes. Natural gas. Um, well, you guys better wear your damn <laughs> oxygen suits. Yikes. Because, I mean, I don't think there's much I can do. 
it's in the water. I assume it will just spread. Like, there's so much of it there. It's going to go everywhere. That is dangerous, though, because I was hoping to send, um, to send this, this crude oil over to my other asteroid. Maybe I'll just, like, section it off. I don't know. How far did it spread? Oh boy. Basically all of this. What do you guys think I should do? Isn't it a bit secure? Yeah. It is. But see, I had looked at the germ overlay and I didn't see any germs. Maybe it had too much pressure in there to produce germs and then as soon as I dug it out it's just like hey free <laughs> have some disease yikes alternatively alternatively no Make some tiles on top. I was thinking about that. I don't know if it will just displace the water back up or or what, but I could try. Like it's all there. Zombie spores. Uh. Just go all the way across. Actually, I make there is eight. So they do the bottom ones first. Come on. <laughs> What are you doing, Devin? Making disease. Are you guys idle? Oh, they're on the other one. Hold on. Hold on. We have an outbreak here. Are you? Oh, no, it's spread in here. Wait, does this, is there anywhere here that is going to go back to my base? No, I don't think so. Okay. It won't get in here because I don't think it can. That's still not good. G'day gaming gamer. What's going on? Uh, we have an outbreak of disease. <laughs> we have an outbreak. I don't know if there's any point. We'll see. We'll see if they will do anything and if it will even stop it. And if it doesn't, I'll just let it go. I'll definitely close that off. They don't care. They don't care. It's not in the air. It's only in the water. Which is interesting. In the oil. And the polluted water. So if it stays like that, then it won't be a problem. But who knows if it will. I don't know if it can spread from water to air. Also, because the the air is so uh, pressurized, it can't off-gas any new polluted oxygen. <laughs> so, 
That could be how we contain it. They're still, they're not doing it. They don't care. There you go. What about this? Low priority. coming to do it. So did it kill it? That still has some zombie spores on it. Yeah. Bugger. It has less though, I think. That has 2000. But up here has like 1,000. <laughs> ah, not much less. That only has 12. Ah, uh, and here, here is basically gone. Sad. Why not do that? Thank you. Okay. That's the main one. I'll just... I'll leave it and I'll keep an eye on it. There's not much we can do about it now. What we can do is go on another rocket mission. Although, first I probably want to put in a toilet, hey? <laughs> probably put in a toilet. I'm sorry. Um... Oh! Empties directly on the other side of the wall. Hell yeah. That's cool. But I don't really have... ...base. Gonna have to move some things around. So they can do that. And how are we doing here? Do we... I haven't seen any... Any points of interest here. As of yet. It's uh, not super warm. Which is nice. This area looks, looks pretty good. Oh! Here's one. Hello. Hey, come on. What do we got? Hot polluted oxygen vent. Ah, that's uh, <laughs> that, that's not ideal. I'm not sure what I could do with that, but it's better than nothing. By by a little bit. Keep going down. Hey! Also, are there any poke shells? I can see some water weed, which is good. We need that for the lettuce. Look how long it takes to grow in the wild. I find that kind of cool. It's an interesting mechanic how and things like this as well. They, they take so long to grow in the wild, 30 days, uh, the water weed takes even longer, 48 days, and then you grow it yourself, 12 days, or 8 days, I like it. I guess it's kind of realistic, kind of? So 
selective breeding and whatnot. Oh, this is the last one. Arcade machine and a signal counter. Counts how many times a green signal has been received up to a chosen number. When the chosen number is reached, it sends a green signal. Cool. Wonder how high it can count. Can it count up to like a thousand? <laughs> Probably not. Probably only like 10 or something. Also, there is a lot of ore around here, like a huge amount of ore. All of this red is ore, all of this yellow is ore, so just like, bang, whole swaths of it. And salt. There's more ore. Dirt. The whole top is, is ore, like all of that is ore. All of this. That is crazy. I mean, it's not the best. Aluminium and gold amount. Gold amalgam is good. Gold amount. So we're probably just going to come back here and strip the entire thing. We'll need to find a, a way to send it back, though. This guy's... Mm. He won't live forever, sadly. Oh yeah, we made some. Cool. We could just send another one, but that will just achieve the same goal. I'll wait till he expires, I guess. We need to do some more research somehow. I'm not sure how to do it because with that with that engine, we could go six, I think. So we could go one, two, and orbit that no problem. We could go visit one, either that or that, and I could go one, two, three, potentially. But I mean, what's the point of going to Sogano? We are, we're already there. <laughs> one, two, I could maybe go there, but I can't see what's there. So you can't travel to a place that you've not explored yet. So we're kind of at the limit of our space travel until we find a better option and where is all the carbon dioxide gone gonna need to get some more in there bugger uh i could just pump it straight out of this potentially going on here is that snipped it goes in there it comes out there comes out there oh it's shut off right 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 okay like, why is that not working? Um, until this is full. And why is this not filling up? Because it's not running. I see. I could... Uh... No, I couldn't. Never mind. Uh, I don't think this is a big problem for now. Because we don't need a huge amount of food. So I'll just let it sit for a bit. I'm curious to see what we get further down here. It looks like it's getting hotter. What is this? This is a event. Did we see what that was? Minor volcano. Well, I mean, that is kind of what you'd expect to find down here, but it's not particularly useful for us right now. Not particularly particularly oh yes that's what I I remember I was a little bit concerned about this turning off in four cycles yikes 
four cycles that is going to turn off and it will remain off for 55 cycles <laughs> Whew. how do we get polluted water in there how no polluted water goes in I don't think it, it doesn't come out of there polluted, does it? Because that would, uh, it would spit out just hotter liquid of whatever comes in, I would have thought. Okay, but yeah, this is going to be a problem. I may set up something to pump this in there and just pray that this turns on soon 20 cycles so we will have a good 18 cycles with no new water and even then we'll have to rely on this this we're just sending all of this out at the moment probably should refine some of it So yeah, that's going to be our mission for today. We can just dig all of this out. E no. Um that's fine. We have a little bit of algae here too, I guess. We could take. We could convert slime into algae as well, if we really wanted. Um I could also go into here. And we can get that polluted water coming out. How warm is it here? This is nice. This is a good zone. I mean, yeah, not for long, but <laughs> it's it's good. Just trying to think. I'm gonna have to build a tank. Probably just copy this. And that will be my tank of clean water. Well, relatively speaking, clean water. So I will get them to do that. They'll probably get stuck because they always do. Uh, yeah, we're, we're not going to make it out of that anymore, actually. Because we're running low. Igneous rock is where it's at. I'm sure we'll we'll strip some more stuff and get heaps more. I think all of our our um, animals are eating it too, which doesn't help. <laughs> but I mean, they gotta eat. Can't really avoid that. So that will be clean water. So, get some conductive wiring. Conductive wiring. Some pipes. May, should it be insulated? I think eventually it will get cold. So, I might make it insulated. So, that's that. And I might just have a kind of uh, filter system. Because here I've got the desalinator and I'll just have some filters as well. So I should probably dig these little pockets out and just let it all fall into there. It's cool enough. It doesn't really matter too much. So, and then I have some more space here.
Yeah. Okay. And I gotta make this priority 6, otherwise none of this is gonna get done. Like, none of anything is gonna get done. And the rest can be 6. I should have just done it all 6 and then made that 7. Okay, cool. There's something so satisfying about having like planning out a bunch of stuff and just letting them go at it and build why does that come out there that can probably go I might uh we'll just dig it all out now Yeah, why not? Hey Perfect Dark, how you doing? Let's see how Robert is faring. Ah, there you go, there's one. I don't really know what to do with those guys, but I know they do make... Um, they make lime. Like their shells, their malts or something like that. Which could be pretty useful, I think. We'll just keep going down. Keep going, see what there is to see. This is... Ooh. Because I know this planet has like a radioactive place in it. And I've never seen any of that before. So, I'm pretty excited to find that. And how did we go? Ooh. Really? It's breaking. Okay. Not sure why. The zombie spores, it seems like they're only prevalent in the liquid. And even then, not that much. Just like right on the top. Which is good. I guess that's, that's probably the best that we could hope for. Did my one way video interview for Virgin to be cabin crew, did a huge mistake. Oh no. I mean, you never know. Maybe you, you think it will be bad, but it ends up they don't. They don't mind it, or I don't know, fingers crossed. <laughs> Video interviews are always so. <clears throat> I don't know. I don't like him. They make me feel weird. Also, something is putting out chlorine. I don't know if it's... What is this? It can't be that. But whatever it is, that's really good. Because that could actually kill the, the stuff. The only bad thing is it's going to sit up above the carbon dioxide. So, not really that helpful over there. Not sure if there's much point doing this, but... Are they eggs? No, it's diamond. <laughs> and we have another one here. I think I'll leave that one for now. I'm not sure what more I want these guys to do.
Ah, no. What is this? You can't mine bleach stone. Bugger. Really? Hopefully you can jump down too. Ah, uh, what is this? Granite. Well, we're probably at the limit of what you can get to then. Sand, salt is okay, but there's more granite there. Bugger! We're finally getting somewhere cool! Uh... Well, I guess I can just, like, mine the surface. Ah, oh, that's annoying. I'll have to send an actual dupe, but there's... I don't know, like, there's not a huge way to survive around here. There's not anything really set up. We've got a little bit of water and a, a pitcher pump, which is nice. Someone has been here before us. I obviously can't get through the Abyssalite, and I can't give this robot more skills. <laughs> Did Jetstar interview and they said I passed? I haven't heard back for three weeks! Maybe call them? I don't know. Sometimes they they just don't check references. I'm pretty sure when we when we got our apartment here, our unit, they just didn't call any of our references at all. Which I mean I don't mind, but it's it's kind of their due diligence, isn't it? To check up on that? I don't know. Project Zomboid, I, I don't think we'll be streaming that anymore. We'll probably still play it a little bit though. It's fun. I do like it. But I, I feel like the, the main difficulty of the game has been achieved. I think we got to a point where we're relatively stable. Now we're just like, how do we go from being able to survive to being able to do things well. Uh. Didn't think it would go out there. It's a bit annoying. It should just water these plants, like they need that water to grow. I remember the game used to be like that. Who's stressed? Who did? Oh no! How come? There you go. I was playing a bit of uh, a bit of The Sims recently in recent times. Um, it's it's a weird game. I never really get into it in a big way anymore, like I used to when I was young. Every time I play, I always feel like, you know, oh, this is fun, and then I play it for a bit, and then I just stop. 
but in a strange way, it's kind of peaceful. I don't know, cathartic. I don't know how to describe it, but I I feel refreshed. I think especially because the way that I'm trying to play, I'm trying to make this character be like me, you know, live in a place like mine, do things similar to how I do, and um, essentially like lead my life in a, in a weird way. So framing it like that, what? Hey, you, you figured out that he's in mid air. <laughs> Ah, uh, he's gonna drown? Nah, he's fine. So yeah, in, in that sense, I can kind of... I don't know, I get a bit of motivation or a bit of reassurance or... It can, it can help me understand, you know, what I need to do and what I should be doing and stuff. That same reason I play too much Animal Crossing. Yeah, I can see that. I mean, Animal Crossing is a little bit less on the realistic side, but it's yeah, it's still the same. The same with games like Stardew Valley. But like, I made I made my character work with like computers and stuff, and I'm gonna gonna become a. I think the closest career you can have to what I do is uh, be an esports gamer or something like that. So I mean, it's it's fairly close. Can't get much closer than that. Okay, uh, that's that's pretty good there. So that's all going to be polluted water. Then we need that water to go through some some of these sieves. Sieves. I I had to put it on that level. I'll have to put it one level down. Boop, 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 boop. Um I can fit one two three Four. Perfect. I'll put two. I'm just thinking like we're going to end up with a lot of water here. So I'm going to want multiple sieves to be able to control that. And I'll need a way to turn it on and off. Next to an automation grid to automatically turn liquid flow on or off. Power 10 watts, that's fine. I was like, I don't want to do it if it's going to cost me too much power. But if it's just that, that's fine. And I'll have one for each. So then I can control it. You go in. You go in. And then out is going to be... Clean water. Clean. I think. Okay. Hi from Brazil. Hello, Brazil. Um, I may even use another grid for this. I have this. This is spare. So I could use that. Or, how much is this? 1500... Yeah, I might use the spare grid. I mean, it's just sitting there. Then we need to get those two. Eh, it's not the prettiest, but it'll do. <laughs> just want to make sure that it doesn't. Explode the wires. That's really it. Okay. That's all 
fives. They're going to have a lot of work to do. Oh boy. Okay. Oh yeah, and uh, the reason why I wanted this connected to automation is because then I could just put like a switch <laughs> and I could turn it off myself. That's pretty handy. I can also make it, I'll put like a little thing here. So if it overflows, I can just be like, nah, stop. Hi, June. Uh, Joya, get some Joya. Ah, we've we've stumbled upon another roadblock. That's granite. That's bleach stone. Bugger. Well, I guess we'll go this way. No, we can't. We can't go in here because that is. Yeah, we'll we'll do what we can. Just dig out there. Get all the way to there. And just explore a little bit here. Potentially. There's Neutronium? Hello. Hello. Ah, oh, wait, didn't we have that already? Oh, uh, polluted oxygen. Oh, fucking hell. <laughs> There's two of them. <laughs> Only thing that's worse than one hot polluted oxygen vent is two hot polluted oxygen vents. It almost seems like the zombie spores are dying. I know that's that's not the case. Damn. <laughs> he lives in the oil. A little bit concerned here. We're going to need some clean water. Uh, that could almost fall in. Thank you for the follow, Anotera. Appreciate that. Although, we have a little bit of polluted. Ah. And that would really mess things up. Nah, maybe not. That's really annoying. Um. Did I put ice in here? Did that melt already? We have 24 tons of ice there at minus five. So that will melt soon. We also have ice here that will, nah, that won't melt for a little while. It's going to take a while because we need to solve the water here is keeping these things running. Without that, they won't run at all. So we do need to figure out how to fix that. I could go and take all the water from here, but that will only be a temporary solution. I could sieve this water. We could do that. Sieve the water.
Uh, we'll just we'll put it over here. We're doing a lot of water sieve work today, I guess. Um, so plumbing from there goes into there and it can just like go out there, uh, or even there. That's fine. Okay. It needs a bit of power. Ooh, look at that circuit. That is one hefty circuit. <laughs> 3,000 watts. No problem. And it needs filtration medium, which would be sand. We've got plenty of sand. We are running low on salt, though. I think I might send some salt from Earthino. This game indefinite. Uh, yeah, yeah, you can play. I've seen people with like 2,000, 3,000 cycles. There is like a end goal, but you don't need to do it. And you can, I think you can continue past that. Uh, what am I doing? Salt. Ah, oh. oh, I've sent it all. No, I haven't. It's a low priority. Did I, oh, I did sweep only. That's why. That's why. Salt. Let's see if we can get like a few tons, maybe. 200. 500. 700. Okay. 500, fine. Okay. That's probably good for now. I could even just uh, disable manual use and they'll... Or disable sweep only and they'll just put a bunch in there. We don't really need salt for much here. What, we, what would I use salt for? Yeah, I'll just do that. We, we need it for oxygen over there, so <laughs> it's kind of important. Did I ever figure out, did I ever put in a system of, if it's not polluted, or if it's not brine, send something else? Might have to at some point. Okay, uh, but in the meantime, also, we can get some steel now, I think. No? Did this work? Did we get refined carbon or did I just make ceramic? I think I might have just made ceramic. Okay. Or in that case, let's get five on each. Go. And how is this doing? G'day April. Good to see ya. Do we need more polluted water here? We've got some. Ethanol. 
Not that we need it, but it's there. Because I could also just bottle up some polluted water and put it in there. Something like here. Or here. Even though that's always going to fall, I think. Is it going to fall? I don't know. And I could put another one of those over here. <laughs> oi, oi, oi. Yeah, all our zombie spores are dying just in the oil. Fair enough. I mean, I would also die in oil, so can't blame him. If I send um, clean water through here, it will just go through, right? It doesn't matter. It's not going to break it. So... I don't know if I want to set this up as well, because we've got quite a few got two already running and they have they don't have enough power <laughs> these things are running as hard as they can 2000 plus an extra 1600 that's 3600 that we're using to power like the entire base I may add a second one second one and should I add batteries? Should we have some batteries? Do you guys say batteries or batteries? Or some some third cursed option. Thanks, June. Very helpful. <laughs> I don't know why. Why do I bother asking you guys stuff? <laughs> uh, yo, yo. This has got to go. Hey, I keep stuffing myself up in the future because I can't put that there. Then that will go straight in. And it doesn't like that. So... Nice. So that's that. Uh, yeah, I might chuck some batteries. How hot is it here? It's not bad. Like, in the cold area, we could just fill it with batteries. Say it the second way. English is not my first language. Really? Wow. Okay. And we'll put some some batteries here. I'll just I'll just say it both ways just to confuse you guys. Because we, we set up a bunch of batteries over on the other place, and that seemed to work really well. It just helped shore up the power a little bit. So how do we keep getting water here? I think it's people, they come back and then they, as soon as they take off their suit, they just like release all of the pee. That they, that they made in their suit. The cycle days. Uh, I guess it's equivalent to days. But it's like, it's not a day because it's not 24 hours. I don't know. It's just cycles. 
One revolution. Ooh, we're close. Automation broadcaster, automation receiver. Receives a green or red signal from an automation broadcaster over vast distances in space. Ah, oh, man, that's so cool. Automatically analyzes adjacent space while on a voyage. Ooh, fancy. Got a little bit of water. Nice. We can probably mop the rest of that. No, we can't. Okay. Okay. How many days we got? What's our timeline? Uh, 2.3 cycles. Then we have this storage. And then this needs to be up and running. Otherwise... We are staffed. <laughs> also, our natural gas is full, like legit full. So I don't know if we should try to collect them more. Or is that going to be fine? Like. I I think it'll last. I think it'll last. It'll only be maybe 20 or 30 cycles when there is no natural gas being produced. That'll be dormant in less than a day. This will be this will keep going for another 40 days. And by the time that comes back, yeah, by the time that turns off, this will be back. So we'll be fine. Not only that, but now we've got hydrogen which we've almost run out of. But we've got that and we've got solar power, which I can always add more. Got this large battery pack. I think we'll be fine. Yeah. They need um, hydropower. That would be cool. I don't know how they would do it. There's steam power. I guess hydropower is steam power, isn't it? Like you use the water to, t or does the water turn the turbine and that creates power? Actually, yeah. It's weird because all of the, well, not all, but a lot of the, the ways of producing power, like coal power, oil power, gas power, whatever, all of those, uh, really steam power it's just you use those things to to make steam <laughs> thank you dishonest appreciate the follow how you doing i think that's right even with uh with nuclear power you just it's all just to make steam Another one of those over here. Yeah. Heating source used to heat up a large amount of water. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But like you think of it. It's like it's the it's the oil or it's the coal that produces the electricity when really you you could use many different things to make heat. All you're doing is making heat by burning it or whatever. Nice gas. I've got two like right next to each other. So handy. Pretty lucky. Most of my power comes from that at this point. Although we've we've kind of pivoted to more renewable sources now. 120? 
Why so low? Getting later in the day, maybe. What is that doing? <laughs> Do I have another? That goes in there. So that's we got polluted water there too, and we're we're almost just wasting that. Well, no, actually, now we kind of need it to grow these because we can't grow them anywhere else. That is really annoying. I wish I have, I had have left those. Because they're going to be a pain to grow now. Might have to see if I can find some more. Don't see the point in manual airlocks. Open for longer so more gas escapes. Manual airlocks? I just, I use liquid airlocks. I, I do wish that they had a, a purpose. Like, there's not much point in building this. Unless you're doing some kind of cheese where you delete substances or something. Like, their intended use is not really what you would make it for. Which is, um, it's unfortunate. Oh, we got refined carbon now, so I could probably... Use a bit of this. Iron to steel? Ah, oh, we need lime. Okay. Can I... Can you get lime from this? Or do you need to get it from... This bad boy. I wonder how many fossils we have. Oh boy. Five kilos. Just, uh... Yeah, we'll make some lime. Not much else you can do with eggshells, I don't think. And uh, how many do I get from fossils? Only five out of a hundred? Come on, man. Um, I might have some more here, though. Fossils. Oh, yeah. Well, I have a little bit more here. <laughs> Little bit more. Okay, I don't want to do that at the moment. Hey, Lampro. This is fine. This is fine here. And how are we doing here? Did we find anything? Whoa! Oh. Aluminium volcano. God damn. Everything here is, uh, it's too hot. Oh wait, did I see this? Oh yeah, that was another polluted oxygen vent. Because of course. So, you... Where can you... You can't get very far, unfortunately. I don't know what to do with him. Preventing another dupe from walking into gas execution? How do you execute someone with gas? Asking for a friend. Bleach stone, I can't mine. Mm. Oh yeah, I can't get out there, of course. Man. 
And I'm stuck there. Welcome in an airtight room, pump a lot of gas, and they suffocate. Cool. Sounds... Sounds great. <laughs> What would you guys recommend I do with this guy? <gasps> a salt water geyser. Oh, it's 95 degrees, but I mean, that's something at least. That's something. We could work with that potentially. And it's probably the end of the map here. Here, I guess. There's a bit more. Yikes. That's scary. Is there a way that you can get better rovers, like ones that can dig through abyssalite and stuff? We've got like a forest biome. I really like those biomes, they're nice. Eesh. You still got a fair bit of juice left. About half. Uh, don't know, buddy. Don't know what to do with you now. Can't get through this granite or bleach stone. It was great when you don't have any Atmo suits. I have Atmo suits, but I wouldn't be able to recharge it over here. I guess we can just start mining the asteroid. We'll just dig it all out. So that way we, we have some stuff to work with when people start arriving. Well, actually, we'll, we'll have this as our starting layer. Yeah. Extremely radioactive. Oh, are they now? Ah, they're not that bad. Oh, this is bad. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's bad. Um, significant hazard. Well... Did I connect that with the wire? Yes. Thank you so much for the follow. Much appreciated. Strength machinery, nice. I can get rid of these ladders now. They have served their purpose.
wonder if I should also dig this out and just drop it in there. We probably have some. We have polluted dirt. I don't know. We'll have to see when this turns off. I'm curious to see just how long this supply will last as well. I could probably pump the rest of it now. It's still relatively cool here. It's crazy, like you can see how much it's warmed up. It looks cold, like minus 30, but this was all like minus 60 when it started. <laughs> so... Goes to show just how, how quickly it can heat up. Ooh! Wait, what? What's breaking? The gas pipe. How come? Why is it breaking? It's 23. Ah, that is minus 50. That's minus 50 as well. Right. Well, 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 uh, Let's have that go in and have carbon dioxide. Just get it to move along a li little bit. Put some more carbon dioxide in the engine. Wait, why are you going in there? <laughs> you don't have to ping me, it's okay. I can see. The chat is not moving that much. I'm not about to send dupe over there anytime soon, so I don't think we'll have any issues. Yeah, I think we just needed to move some of the, the gas over a little bit. Because it was sitting in this really cold environment for a long time. Yeah, I could go and send another rover, but what's the point? Like, it will just be able to dig out as much as the first one will. Uh... Oh yeah, I was making the toilet. Why? Must be built in a corner on the ground. Is that not a corner on the ground? I've got plastic. Like, right, it's a corner on the ground. Maybe this is just too... It's just... Oh, oh like that! I see. Oh, I had more space than I thought. Okay, that's cool, but it needs a, an intake, does it? Liquid intake. Uh... I don't know about that. Wait, what? Yeah, it's fine. I'm not about to put in a massive liquid reservoir or something. But I could just like put a little bit of water in, keep it in the pipes here. The temperature is fine in there. But that would be annoying because then I would have to take water, clean water. I could take a little bit from here and draw it all the way through there. Uh.
Not sure. It might just be easier to put an outhouse. <laughs> that could just be way easier. It's like, bang, there you go. <laughs> it might be a little stinky, but it's it works better. And then as for sleeping, gonna have to sleep up there, I guess. Out of bed. Bang, you sleep up there. Okay, that solves that problem. They'll they'll do that when they're when they're ready. And we've almost fixed this. It's almost ready to go. We still have is this still half a day to go? Not looking forward to that, guys. Not one bit. Oh, we got lime. Hello. Steel. Uh, we need... Iron. Of course. We need iron. We only have four tons of iron here. But we can get a bit, maybe we get 20. Start working on that. Mm, yes, warming up. How much plastic? We almost have 10 tons of plastic. Hell yeah. I think I will just like, we're, we're starting to get more work in, like spare work. Now that the, the survival part, we've got pretty much down pat, I think. So now I can start clearing these areas, which is good because it means we'll get a lot of uh, resources that might have been running a bit low, like sandstone and stuff like that get a bit more of those uh, I forgot what this was what was this polluted water Polluted water. Not bad, not bad. It'll be very hot though. But we could use that in a pinch if we got stuck. And it would also be semi-useful to like keep the place warm. If that is, if that was my goal. Like for something like pinch of pepper for example. Keeping it warm may be an issue later on. It's also inside my grid, which is helpful. Thank you. Is that a... That's a meal wood. Those still exist? <laughs> And so this is kind of the end of the biome here. I could grab a couple extra tiles here, but I think I'll just extend this all the way down. We'll just close it off there. I don't particularly need to go down there to travel that far down, but they can if they want. And I could move this down there potentially. But yeah, just give him some, some little tasks to do. And as for you, might wrangle him. He's only 10 years old. He's, a, he's but a baby. This is full. Should it not be sending stuff out? What? Wait, where did the slime long come from? 
Hey, yo. How does that have so much slime on? What? What are we feeding them that has slime on? Sandstone? Sandstone. And, and slime. Whoa. Who said you could feed them slime? Bruh, come on. It just gets... <sighs> it's auto-selected like that? Dude, I would have never allowed that. Oh, boy. There's polluted dirt too. How did that happen? How did it happen? That one was fine. Um, I should probably put a deodorizer here. Deodorizer? Is that what it's called? Yeah. No big deal, but... Ah. Ah. <laughs> I'm still not sure why this isn't working. Sending a green signal to this. Enable building. So it's ah, oh, cause there are no eggs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Never mind. They're all critters. Have any chlorine? You can put some in the room and clean it out. Yeah, I, I don't think I have any just offhand. It's probably not worth it to be honest. It's just slime long. It'll it'll die on its own. Good day, LTG. Airlock mod to keep other air from getting through regular airlocks. I, I feel like airlocks need to be rejigged because yeah they they don't work like airlocks they are they're not airlocks at all <laughs> can I sweep that no I would like to though hey Bon hello hello how's the rent in Melbourne uh I think it went, on average, came down a little bit during the pandemic, but it's probably gone up just as quick. Get a pip squeak. It's not that bad. I'd say if you're looking at getting a one bedroom place, it would be maybe 350, 400 with a nice, 400 plus if you want like a, a really nice place or well, not really nice but I I currently pay about 400 for two bedrooms but like it's an okay place it's not super nice decent location it depends what you want I guess of course Hello? This circuit... Uh... Ah, because we're using that. Okay. It doesn't have that much on it. I should, um... I'll leave it. It's fine. It's only going to break like once in a blue moon. It's not worth replacing the entire thing because of that.
Wait, what? Yeah. Talk about breathability. You can breathe just fine. Did I research that? Yeah. This is looking pretty good. I'm happy with that. Um, I may want to build this a bit higher. Then green signal if below. Be above, no? We run out. Damn, we ran out. Did not expect that. Okay, um, I might disable this for the time being because we seem to have used a lot. <laughs> Wait a sec. No, we're gonna need more, right? <laughs> so this is gonna need to be in use. Okay. I'm happy with our oil production. That's looking good. Still not sure what to do with this one. <laughs> I'll probably have to go like... <laughs> like, um... It, it will need to somehow go into there. So like that, and then have that go even higher. But it doesn't need to be done now. It's fine for the time being. Otherwise, they won't be able to get across. So do these have zombie spores? No, I don't think so. Cool. This is fairly important. We're running quite low. It's in temperature, 19 degrees. Can I sweep? I can just sweep the oil. Because of course I can. Uh, everyone's a bit stressed. Ultimately, I'm going to want to produce better food here, but I don't really have access to better stuff to make. I could start trying to make sleet wheat or something like that. That's probably the only other option I have. I could put... See, I can't even use these for cooling. 
now. And sleet wheat needs like water and stuff too, doesn't it? Uh, oxygen. Yeah, dirt and water. And I just don't have water. None. No water. So. I have a little bit of polluted water. That's about it. And that is going down very quickly too. Hey, problems. Gonna have to think of a way to solve them eventually. Ah, uh, Robert, what did you do? You won't be able to get out there. You can try. I'm pretty excited by this project though. Also potentially, if I did want to go further, I could replace this or a module sugar engine sugar engine wait you're gonna tell me how it works at least come on higher height restrictions wait, higher restrictions so you can go further I guess Move slower, that's fine. Okay. Use the sucrose. I don't know if I have any sucrose. Sucrose, I got a tiny bit. Teeny tiny. But it's, I don't think it's enough to make a rocket out of. We'll stick with carbon dioxide for the time being. Oh. Wait, did we stop sending it or are we out? Surely we're not out. Oh, no power. Huh? No power. Ow. Ow. Oh. Oh, I disconnected it. I mean, honestly, not a bad time. Because it was full anyway. It would have just been sending all of our stuff out into the ether. A, uh... I'll just, I'll disconnect it. Yeah. We can keep it in there. Keep our 163 kilos per tile. Hey boo. G'day, how you doing? I stress, uh, over on our other, other land, yes, yes. I'm tempted to leave this here, because I don't know how much the pressure can withstand, but... I mean, polluted water should be fine, it's only really oil that makes it break, in my experience. Class, uh... What class do you have? Uh, 
How did you get hurt? Twenty tons of coal because we dug this little bit out. Hell yeah. And how do we go with that iron? Oof. We can make steel. Hey, hey, hey. I'm gonna heat that water up a little bit, but not that much. Where? Where are you entombed? Oh, building entombed. I don't care. <laughs> Who cares? It's just like fucking chlorine in there. Oh no, the chlorine is trapped. Software design. Okay, that sounds cool. I recently, I started doing like a, I guess you could call it a course. It's, it's more like just kind of watching videos and stuff and doing a little bit of reading, um, online. It's like a, the science of well-being course, which is pretty interesting. I'm always kind of curious to learn more about that kind of stuff. Yeah, I've been doing that for two weeks or so. Pretty chill. Pretty chill. Learning about like the things that make you happy and things that you think will make you happy but but don't. <laughs> Bit concerning, but Yeah, that's gonna die pretty soon. We'll disinfect this, I think. Uh how do I Bet and bet. No. Okay. I've always. Oh, you all. What's going? Uh. Ah, not this shit again. How many times do the pipes get backed up here? I'm gonna have to make a liquid reservoir. I'm just so sick of these pipes getting backed up again and again and again. Uh, so that just goes in there. That goes into there. And then out there. So, they'll do that. Make it seven. Whatever. Try to apply things you learn. Yeah, well, I mean, one of the things they were saying before is just like how everything that you think will, will make you happy, like getting good grades, getting good money, Having a, you know, being in a good relationship and, you know, looking nice, all of that stuff, like, just doesn't make you happy. <laughs> so it's like, okay, I mean, it, it's, that's cool to know, but it, then it's like, well, what makes you happy then? Like, that's a lot of stuff. <laughs>
Also, social media is like really shit. Not only does it not make you happy by like looking, because you look at all these people who who are in like really good situations, like fuck, you know, what I've got is shit. Not only that, but even if you see people who are like not doing well, that doesn't make you happy either. So like you can't win. <laughs> Discord. Yeah, I mean, there's obviously nuance to everything. Not every social media is the same. And um, they have different purposes. Yeah, we need to use this more. Because we've, well, we're running out. How are we going for this? We still got natural gas, which is good. Bit of a mess, but it works, okay? Don't, don't question it, okay? <laughs> Whatever the fuck that is. Hey Swamp, how's it going? They left, did they? I'm sure they'll be back. I think they've left like three or four times already. Dig it all out, whatever. You can jump that far right. Column. Column or row? So now, hydrocarbon propulsion. Petroleum engine. We could feasibly do that. We could. We do have petroleum. A little bit. We've got oil to easily be able to make more. So we'll work on that. Can I deconstruct this? I can. Uh, it, oh, you just get a bit of copper. You know, I... I probably don't want this water to... to come out of there. Might be better to keep what I have, because who knows if I'll need it. Okay, we're out of water. It's gone. We've got a fair tank. Like, that is a sizable amount. It will take a while for that to run out. Not to mention, we've got pipes going all the way around there, full of water. So, we've got a decent amount. Uh, hydrogen, we are out. That's fine, because that's a backup power anyway. 
How much glass we got? Almost two tons of glass. Nice. And this is currently being set up. Okay. So, yeah, I can dig all of this out. Oh, it's such a shame that these won't work. Such a shame. Volcano. Uh, yes, we, we have a volcano. Like here or something. Volcano here. I'm not going to use the volcano to heat up the reed fiber. <laughs> that's uh, that's not going to happen. All right, let's send some more. What is this buddy bud? Should I send the polluted oxygen in here? I just realized I could. I could just change this into that. So then it will only be natural gas. Aha! And then I could potentially save that somewhere. Hi Chenny. Good to see you. Eat. Take me away from what I'm doing just for that. Come on. Yeah, I know. It tells me they're starving and we've got like 180,000 thousand calories. Like, come on. <laughs> Who are you trying to kid? Yeah, I'm pretty good, Chani. I'm pretty good. Nah. I disagree. As for this place, there's not a whole lot more I can even do here. Even in this small area, there's not much left. I'll probably just close it off there, to be honest. Just close it off. Where? Oh, geez, we're out of water. What is this being used for? Ah, those guys. Shit. Um. Hmm. Do I, is it time that I turn those off?
Because we've got dust caps. We've got uh We've got dust caps. <laughs> or I could I might have to use this. That's polluted water. Like this is still clean. It doesn't have any disease at all. So I'm kind of hesitant to get more water from from that. Hey, uh... Shit, I, I wish I had realized earlier. We have this, which is not melting. Probably because it's not dipped in the water. Um... to think. What do I do? Good day, Swamp. We'll dunk that in, for starters. Because then it will, it will heat up. I thought he just picked it straight back up. Twenty-five point four. It's gonna take a while. I could put a liquid tepidizer to warm it up. Must be fully submerged. I don't know if that counts as fully submerged. It also uses a fair bit of heat, uh, power. 960 watts. Whew. That's a fair bit. Converts water into ice. That's kind of the opposite of what I want. Oh, we have Sweepy. I remember Sweepy. I wish instead of like turning into water in one big block, if it was like real ice, it would slowly convert into water over time. I don't know if that would be better or worse for the game, but it would be good for me right now. In the meantime... Uh, in the meantime... What am I going to do? What is that biome there? I don't know. It's just gonna run out eventually. We've still got a little bit of time. And at the moment, the only thing we use this water is for these. So when it runs out, we won't be able to grow bristle blossoms. Which is only really... It's about... 60,000 kilocalories. Where we've got another... F another 60,000 is mushroom. So... We'll be okay. There's a flaking mechanic that causes ice to melt. There is? It doesn't always come into play. Interesting. I forget if um, having dirty water and using that to grow crops will mean that the crops that you get will also have dirty stuff, will also have germs. I for always forget that. Also, we could potentially grow this. Does this need water? It needs fertilization. But what can I grow out of this? Can 
because I could just like get these grub grubs to help grow it. Germs die when you cook them. Okay, that's not bad then. Yeah, maybe I should try to grow better crops. And wait, what temperature do they need? Up to 50. Ah, nice. So they would be pretty easy to grow. But it, it doesn't say like what you can make out of them. Let's have a look. You can make that. That's plus one. Which is about the same as that and that. So, I mean, that in itself. Oh, plus sucrose. Where do we get sucrose from? You just, they eat it. It's produced sulfur sweetle. Ah, so you need both of them. Jeez. That's a bit convoluted, isn't it? It's a bit convoluted. Lettuce, pinch of pepper. Ah, bugger. <laughs> if there was one that used like mushroom gristle and grub fruit that would that would work all right well i mean it's it said it didn't need water did it so no so we could just grow it If you put farm stations in with blossoms, it translates to 33% less water usage. Does it? I thought, uh, I thought they just sped up the growth cycle. Increase plant growth rates. Does that mean that it grows faster or that it produces more? Okay, uh, but it consumes fertilizer. How much fertilizer do I have? Seventy-four kilos. Seventy-four kilos? Really? What is it being used for? That seems quite low. And how much is five kilos? So I'd only get like twelve uh twelve uses out of it. <laughs> hmm. What was I what have I been using the fertilizer for? I don't even know. Maybe have I been feeding it to these guys? I doubt it. They've been eating all my sandstone. And algae. Get out of here. Oh, come on. <sighs> I swear it just chooses whatever. Why would I knowingly feed them that? I don't know what to feed them actually. I don't really want these hatches. I don't care. <laughs> uh, they can eat. It's all kind of shit, isn't it? Dirt? I feel like dirt is useful though. I'll just let them die. Whatever. i just die. <laughs> Such a nice guy. Should have some eggs. I think. No. 
See, now our critter killing area won't even work because there's not enough water to kill them. <laughs> Um, so, farm tiles, don't need water, we'll try to grow some, we'll see how it is, we'll have to get down here, how do we catch them, grub grub, <laughs> grub grub eggs? Maybe they have laid some eggs, I don't know. Uh, oh, look at those guys. They look cute. Why the doors? What's wrong with the doors? These doors are at the top so that the carbon dioxide won't go out. If that's what you're wondering. Ah, uh, Barney? It's Barney, yeah. Stop it! Popped eardrums, breast, food poisoning, wet, eye irritation, yucky lungs. Yeah, that'll do it. That will do it. Um, <laughs> why the popped eardrums? Oh yeah, going from that to that will will probably do it. Yeah. Um, I need to really just like put all of this. Wait a second. Oh yeah, that's fine. This all needs to kind of be in the base. It's shit that it's it's out here instead. Ah, oh, now it's all it's all seeped through there. That's why. Because in order to get here, they go through water, you go through all of this. I might just... I could open this up. The temperature... It's not that bad. The temperature is okay here. So they won't, like, freeze. And then it'll stop them from being wet and stuff. I think... And this, even if the pressure from there goes out here, this will probably help clean it a little bit. I mean, yeah, I think we'll be fine. Famous last words. We'll, uh, we'll deconstruct that. See how we go. Algae ethanol. Might take a bit of algae actually. Oh, you broke the grill. Come on. No one wants to repair? Excuse me? Forbid mutants. Interesting. Master ruining your beard. Really? Oh. That's a shame. Ha <laughs> 
Alright, you have to go on the other cycle, I think. Other schedule. Keep getting sick and stuff. Yeah, because they get like eye irritation and all that stuff here. Whereas if if I can make this all habitable, maybe I put this down here instead and make it all oxygen. Then that'll that'll really improve their mood because they just go through that every day. Go wet, cold, eye irritation. Every day. It's not ideal. Oh, they fixed it. Okay. Did they fix, uh, they eventually build this? No, still haven't built it. Okay. We got a lot of oil. Damn. Uh, I might turn this off. Because we've got quite a bit. Wait a second. Okay. I'm just worried that they're going to bring the water with the zombie spores and put it in here. Okay. I think the food poisoning will probably kill the zombie spores. <laughs> but that's fine. Hi, Speedy. How's work? Uh. Don't want the oil to fall out. Although it did get rid of a lot of the polluted water, which is nice. Everyone here is stressed. Oh, that's so terrible. I shouldn't have given them improved stats, improved their skills. That was a mistake. Grand opening. Yeah, I heard. How'd it go? See you, Swamp. Alright, let's do this next. Because I think this is done. I just need to do that. Ah, okay, of course. The one thing they didn't do is because it was five instead of six. So. That is, yes, it's currently not connected. Oh, I didn't, I didn't put a bridge in here. Okay.
Nice. Awesome. Nice. It's cool. I'm sure you'll tell me more about it later. Okay, water level's still quite high. That's good. I could go somewhere else, but I just don't know what the point would be. And they still haven't built this. Oh well. I mean, you can tell me now if you want, if you want, if you'd rather type it out instead of telling me. I just, I figured you'd have like a lot to say. players were there. Nice. Which ones? Any good ones? <laughs> this just keeps going. I'll need to dig into into here as well to take those guys. Hello. They've come to yoink them. Dane Swan, Adam Cooney. Ah, past players. Cool. I thought you meant like current players. Fev. <laughs> Fev. Damn. That would have been fun. What is he doing there? You better get out of there. You're gonna get stuck. Good. Uli Gibson. Very nice. No current players then? Just all past players? I mean not not that those players are not good. So I have eight seeds. Cool. Hydro cactus. It just produces water. <laughs> oh, it converts polluted water into water. That's interesting. And how many cycles? Ten cycles. Oh, this plant eats critters and produces hydrogen. Bruh. The fuck is that? A forest with Feb and Swanee. Hell yeah, man. That's awesome. Ah, you got stuck, huh? You had to do it. How did that even happen? You were the one who created it.
No, they're, they're both going to get each other stuck. <laughs> ah, nice. See, how come you couldn't do that before? Lately, dupes get stuck a lot. Yeah, I don't know what it is. It's not cool. But anyway, we can start growing some grub fruit. Yeah. So max radiation is fine. So now we've unlocked this mutations tab, which is interesting. Sulfur is going to be the one. Actually, we'll need a critter drop off thing. So you, gonna have to wrangle you, and you. <laughs> I mean, we'll take you as well. Why not? <laughs> and maybe we'll go in here to get some more of these. Just grab them. Oh, and you guys. Hello. Gone. It just it's all granite. Just a massive, massive chunk of granite. And then whatever that is. Igneous rock. Okay. Look at that coal. Lovely coal. Uh, what, so what do they eat? They eat sulfur. They eat sulfur and produce mud. They eat sulfur and produce sucrose. And then the sucrose is used for this. So we're gonna need a critter feeder here too, aren't we? Okay. It's a work in progress. Mount Rushmore. Yeah, it's just a big slab. Also Oh we managed to Get 30 data analysis research. Nice. I didn't, I thought that would be our, our limiting factor, but we managed to do it. Also, this is probably done now. No, they just don't want to do that last bit. Okay, I get it. I get it. So that goes in. Uh, where does it normally go? It goes into there. Okay. Well, I will snip it after here because we might not want it going in there. And then this water, this will be clean water. And when, if this runs out, We'll need that clean water to go in and take this path here. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm pretty excited by this. This is cool. Oxygen is still good. Oh, it's, it's perfect. Like, couldn't be any better.
And plastic 9.6 tons. Okay, let's go. Oh shit. It's not going that great here. <laughs> they still, like, they're not really doing anything. How is this? Low priority. Hopefully they build that. They need to seal that off. How are we going here? We got a little bit. Yeah, they just gotta finish that. So, close that off, get that finished. Um, then... It's unfortunate, I really should have just put this up here instead. That would have been better, but it's, I think it's, is it too late for that? Is it too late to just put this here? Maybe I'll do that instead. And I'll move that further over. Because then everything is just lined up, it's flat. It works better. Uh, that's 2000. Is that the same circuit? It is. Um, wait, hold on. <laughs> no, but we can't. We can't because then they'll have to go down. Put the suit on, then go down. Uh, no, it'll work. It'll work. It's fine. I don't even know how natural gas got out here. How? Where did it come from? It can't get through there. It can't get through here. Like what? Did it go all the way around? Oh, <laughs> that broke. <laughs> got me good. Ah, you are having a laugh. Well done. Well done, game. Okay. Well then, leave that there. And what I'll need to do, I'll need to put a wall here as well, or a, a door, where are the doors? Doors there, so that they can't go around this way. And I'll need to put a door here as well. <laughs> Which is a bit unfortunate. Should also put in some fire poles. Ah.
this will definitely make them a lot happier in the long run. So, I'm hoping they get onto that quickly. And building in base as well will also keep them more content. Have we got disease in there yet? That's just food poisoning. Okay, cool. So that, that will keep him busy for a little while. That and a critter feeder. Critter feeder, blah, blah, blah. There you go. That one. I don't know if we, do we need to like groom them? I think they just do whatever. Why is this halted? Fertilization. Okay, that's fine. Both halted. Why? You gotta give me a reason. <laughs> you can't just say halted. It's probably the, the atmosphere, I imagine, but. If you want them to tend crops, you don't have to groom them if you want to make meat and sucrose, you need to tend them. Okay, I just want them to grow the stuff, so that's fine. So, grub grub. And... It's at the end, at the start and at the end, nice. As for food... Well, yeah, that's about it. They don't eat much. Keeps it nice and simple. Did we wrangle them or not? They got unwrangled. Uh, take them all. So we should probably keep track of sucrose. Sucrose and what was the other one? Sulfur. We've got a fair amount of sulfur. So like they'll eat the sulfur and make sucrose. So you'd think we'll be alright growing these crops. But you never know. We'll find out soon enough. It's just nice to be able to diversify a little bit. Diversify, yes. Um, because our water is is gone. <laughs> Ice is oh, it's lost three degrees. That's about it. Uh, I don't know, what else will we grow here in place of this? It'll just die and then that's it. it. I guess it'll come back when the ice eventually melts. Keep them wild, you might not even have to feed them. Yeah, I don't know how, how much they'll produce, but we'll see how it goes. I also don't know if it needs to be a one-to-one -one thing like do I need two of these and two of those or do I need like one of these and two of those or we'll find out wait did I dig the I'm trying to think of a good use for my plastic as well because I could put in some transit tubes. You guys know me. I love my transit tubes. But like I'm not going to just place them for fun. 
And I was thinking I could make it to go up here, but we don't really have a use for this place that much. I could go from from here to here could be somewhat useful because then they could make the, the forge stuff making glass and stuff like that. Maybe I'll do that. Would that be worth it? Oof, what a shitty wire. Let's get rid of that. Friends, a tube. I love these things. <laughs> these are like my favorite things, I swear. It's a little bit finicky though. Does that work? Or does it need to go up one? Probably needs to go up one. Bruh, thank you. <laughs> then we have a joint plate. As a tube crossing. But it's annoying because it can't go across ladders. That's really annoying. It also can't go on that. Or that. So it'll have to like eh. I don't know if that'll work, but we'll see. Eee. That's that's half my plastic right there. <laughs> so that's that. And then I need a a way to come out somewhere. I can get rid of all these ladders. Um Buildings. Get rid of those. And then... It could just come out here. Like, bang, or something like that. Yeah, nice. Because, like, there's already lots of power here, so that won't be a problem. And I'll need to take the power to here. That heavy watt wire... I could take it across, like, there. It's only, what is it, 900 or something? Nine sixty. Hmm. So it's a fair bit. <laughs> it's not a small amount. How much is this? 2600? Yes, nice. What about this? 2500, alright, so we will need another one. Uh, 
Oh, he can't go through the door. <laughs> oi, oi, oi. Come on, man. Gotta go over it. Or we could just have the... Have the transformer come out here. <laughs> Nice. And I could probably take this, this bit here as well. Yeah, I'll take that. So they'll do that. In due time. How are we faring here? Okay, so I kind of want to just flick this on. That's off. That's off. And um, see if it works, you know? I mean, I'm sure it will work, but I want to see it in play. Okay. So. You know, if you don't type in chat, you're not considered a viewer and you're invisible? No, surely not. That can't be true. Okay, so that's that. Then, I will turn just one of them on. I remember they changed what counts as a viewer, but I, I didn't see that as one of them. It's, um, uh, the way that they explained it, the way that I understood it was basically if you have the stream playing and like you can see the video of the stream and it's playing, then you are a viewer, you're a live viewer. So. You, if you had like the chat open, but not the stream, then you're not a live viewer. Um, but like if you had the stream muted, you're a viewer, you know, whether you come from a raid or whatever, you still count as a viewer. As long as you have the video part of it open. That's, that's what I understood. Hello Katarina. How are you faring this fine morning? Guys, guys, guys. Please. Let's get this set up. Like, I just... They need to reduce a little bit of stress. I think I'm going to take you off. Put you back on phone time because we just need people to do things. Putting me on another tab doesn't count as a viewer. As long, well, if the video is playing on another tab, then you are a viewer. Yes, that's fine. Yeah, so you can watch multiple streams and be a viewer of each. That's fine. annoying ideally I would have this like at the bottom and just take everything back up all of this natural gas and whatnot just take it all back doing well just made stuffed bell peppers nice we have a bell pepper in the fridge and we've had it there for like two weeks so now it's it's gonna have to go in the bin <laughs> Out of all like the fruit and veg that we buy, for some reason, that's always the one that we just forget to eat. 
I'm not sure why. I love them. They're so tasty. Yeah, we do call them capsicum. I just said bell pepper because you said bell pepper. So you can understand, you know? <laughs> I'm considerate like that. This is how we get our water. Yeah, legit, the zombie spores are gone. Amazing. Ah, they ain't shit. Oh, we got nine zombie spores there. <laughs> how did that happen? 295 in the oil, but we'll mop it up and then there'll be none. Ah, uh, maybe because we have... What is this? Bleach stone. My hero. <laughs> My hero. Play, praise the bleach stone. Why is this disabled? Oh yeah, it's fine. New printables. What do we got? I wish clicking on the printables thing opened the printing device on that asteroid. It's annoying how it always goes back to the main colony despite the fact that I want them here. I'm gonna work for the government and help them with the voting system. Hell yeah! Nice. We have a we have an election coming up soon as well. In May as well, I think. So they they have those jobs going around too. What a strange coincidence. So I'm gonna put this here. We don't need a liquid lock because we have one there. I'll put, I mean, we only need four because we have four dupes. I'll put five because, no, I'll put four. Fuck you. <laughs> and then that has to go. In there. That's almost already connected. Cool. Uh, that's it. It's pretty easy to set up, to be honest. And then I need to think about how I'm going to get rid of the... the bad shit in here. I think I will move that to the bottom. Or really just have it on. Have it turn on and just clear everything out. I think it's it's inevitable that there will be some carbon dioxide sitting down there because the dupes will breathe. So as long as it clears everything beyond this point, it'll be fine. So let's have... What does it detect now? Natural gas probably. Yep. Just send all of that out. Whatever. Jumping and saying hello, gotta go have a big test. Good luck, good luck on your test. Thanks for popping in, appreciate it. Been a while. Okay, so they're doing that. Oh, how is our, how is our little rover doing? He's probably battery off now, isn't he? Where did he go? Where did he go? Oh, he went underwater. No. <laughs> oh, rest in peace, Rover. You'll be missed. Okay. Well, that's that. 
there's no way to like charge them up on the fly, is there? Can I make a battery and rebuild him? Oh, that's so sad. Okay, we got Sweetles moving to plant, but we haven't managed to wrangle these guys. Get two of each and see how we go. They growing. Sweetle tending. Wait, so do we need both? Or do we just need... I guess they produce the food for each other, right? So like one produce food for you, then you produce the food... You produce the food for the plants, so you kind of need both. Uh, this is... it hasn't really moved much at all. That's good. How is this going? Getting some water in. I mean, there's no particular reason to keep this as polluted water. Beyond sending it over to the other place. Speaking of which, we may need a bit of a top up there. But it's good that it works. That works quite well. And it, uh, it does not have any germs. Somehow. <laughs> How does this not have germs? Oh, because it comes out of here. With no, with no germs. Is that right? That's incredible. I might not add into there then. On my research in Canada, you only need to work for two years to get citizenship. Australia need to live there for four years for citizenship. We are pretty strict. We're pretty strict with that stuff. Unfortunately. Let me get rid of that then. It's worth it though. It's a nice place. <laughs> can recommend. Oh, we did it. Hello. Nice. Grub, grub, rub. <laughs> Hell yeah. So it had Sweetle tending. Did it also have... And this has grub, grub, rub. Growth speed 50%. Oh <laughs> boy. Uh, lots of enormous spiders in Australia. If you live in the city, in like a, a house that's not dilapidated, you probably won't see too many spiders. And the ones that you do see, they'll be like just daddy long legs ones, not harmful at all. I, I honestly can't remember the last time that I saw like a dangerous spider in my house. It, it was such a long time ago. How the hell can you be idle with the amount of things that we have to do unless you're trapped? Ah, okay. <laughs> Fair enough then. You silly man. I have some. The only spiders I have in my home are the daddy long legs ones. And honestly, I don't mind them that much. It's different if you have like 50 of them or something. But they... They like trap and eat mosquitoes and ants and things like that. So, I don't mind. They're nice. We're, we're buddies. <laughs> what is that?
orb weaver spiders. Uh, I don't know if we have them or not. I don't think I've seen any. We have um, the dangerous one that we have. We've got uh, huntsmen. I don't know if they're like particularly lethal, but they they look pretty scary at least. And we've got red backs, which are dangerous, kind of. Yeah, you can get rid of them. Fine. Insufficient, my ass. How the hell can you call that insufficient? Also, all of the carbon dioxide fell into here. Get fucked. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Ice is 20 degrees. So yeah, I could potentially pump this water out there to grow the gristle. Gristle? Bristle. Blossom. Tongue twister. If I wanted to. Oh, well, they built some of that. Well, oh, wow. Ah, yes. Uh, I'm going to tentatively say that will be fine. Now let's go back to here and see how they're coping. They really do not want to do this. Even though it's like a very high priority. Oh, they're finally doing it. Okay, thank you. <laughs> it's important, all right? Here in the Philippines when I was a kid, we like to catch spiders and make them fight for gambling? Wow. I mean, that's kind of impressive. I wouldn't have even thought to do something like that. Here comes the salt. <laughs> Look at that, 11 tons now. Hell yeah. What is it then? Chlorine? I should just get it to send everything. Disabled by automation grid. But it's not connected. You. Uh. Really? What a bummer. When you lose, you're not just going to lose money, but you're going to lose your own spider too. Do people, do they get like attached to the spiders? Well, where did our food go? We had like a hundred thousand kilocals the other day. I guess it, it rotted or something. It's, I mean, this is grown now. Do we need more polluted water? I think we're okay. Daughter had a spider fight club. Wow. That's kind of crazy. Like a whole, whole racket. Damn. So, 
Is there anything I can grow? No. No. Frost pot. Jesus. Almost. If only I had sleet wheat, then I could get this mixed berry pie. That would be really good. I can do... I could do this. But that would require a lot of sucrose, which I don't have. I could definitely do that though. That's a bit... Not that good. But we'll do it for now. What asteroid is this? Um, so this one is the standard one, Terrania, just like the default asteroid. And then we've got the swampy asteroid here. And I just found this one, which I think is like beach and it has some kind of forest as well. It's got a big hole in it too. Not much atmosphere. Probably should have like closed it off. Because <laughs> there's nowhere to breathe. Oh well. Maybe next one. Put them on a stick and bring them close until they start fighting. I didn't even know like that they fought each other. Different spiders. Thought they would have like worked together. They're friends or something. This also has no pollution so... Why do they not do that? We could um, pump that into there as well. Or I could just pump it down there. Yeah. What is that? Liquid bridge. Ah. Like that. Gonna need, oh wait, need a wire bridge. And a ladder. I prefer to mop that up if I can though. No. Well, never mind. <laughs> so they grow so quickly. Four cycles. This has got Sweetle tending, but the one that had the the grub rub overcrowded, really? Oh, oh. metabolism, sad. Maybe I only need one of each. Are you glum too then? No, he's happy. Hmm. 
Maybe they need less space. There's an asteroid based in Australia. It's called Flipped. Ha ha ha. Very funny. Also, we don't need this on anymore. That's all natural gas. I need to think of how to... So yeah, that's... All of this is natural gas. Cool. So... I will... Snip that. And just all go in there. And then we'll connect the next one. Nice. So we collected 75 kilos of natural gas out of that. Pretty damn good. And now all of this can go in there. So that... All of it can go in. Let's not make it out of that. We'll make it out of igneous. Do you call flip-flops in other terms? Uh, we say flip-flops. We also call them thongs. Backs? What's a tea bag? So this is looking for polluted oxygen. I mean, it can just send everything. Polluted oxygen works too. Laundry. Ah, oh, g-string. Like, hey. How did it get over pressure? How? Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. It'll work on it eventually. It's trying hard. I think it's also because that is higher than the carbon dioxide, so it needs to push past it to get to where it wants to go. And I mean, it's hard to push like 150 kilos of stuff out of the way. <laughs> uh, we've used some of this. Uh -huh. Use none of that though. How does that have insufficient power? Eh, how? It's connected. Because it doesn't have the tube. Roast grub fruit nut. Nice. Ranching sweetles and grub fruit together is a bad idea. So what should I do? Like, don't they need to be together? Or should I do... Don't 
Do they need each other to grow? I mean, they seem to be growing fine. It doesn't matter too much if it grows quicker or slower. I've got plenty of food. I just want the stuff that each of them produce. When I was new to dating apps, men often mentioned they would like to see you in a G-string. Ew. <laughs> You thought they wanted you to play the guitar? Oh, Oh, that's so innocent. <laughs> oh. Which string is the G one on a guitar? Oh, there we go. We got to the bottom. It's magma. And neutronium. That is literally the bottom. Cool. Uh, fair bit of nothing around here though. All right, let's uh, let's head out this way maybe. See what there is out here. Ah. I wanna try to leave the wildlife intact if I can. Just do some reconnaissance. Bubbles. Now you'll find bubbles. Eat the food. Do it. Bongs are a different thing than G strings. Eh. Kind of the same. Pretty much the same here, anyway. Okay, so that's all carbon dioxide. And we'll send that out too. So this one is empty. You get rid of it. And next we will get this bad boy. <laughs> We're slowly getting through them. So I can get rid of all of that. And as for you, I just need to go like that. Stop making it out of sandstone, I swear to God. Oh no. <laughs> Gloomy, what are you doing? Polluted water. Well, well. <laughs> if you guys would do this, then you wouldn't be so stressed. Just leave that, whatever.
Oh no. Yeah, it just keeps going. Damn. Main difference is G-string goes in between thong sit on top. Okay. Gotcha. <laughs> Oh boy. How much gloomy? Okay, you better now? Good. Let's just... I'm gonna force him to do this. And... I don't know what the gas is here. I might, uh... Instead of doing that, I might just get rid of this. So that it works. It just sends whatever. And I can probably get rid of the skimmer here. Because it's not necessary if we have this. And then I don't need to put water in there. I mean, we weren't using it anyway. Get rid of all of that mess. That's fine. Okay, there you go. So then if I, if I don't want that to work, I will just uh, turn it off. Someone's breaking stuff. <laughs> How is there no food? How? Is it because they're not, they're not like harvesting it? That's uh... That's not good. I mean, like we have so much food. Come on. How do we go from a hundred thousand to zero? Find that hard to believe. At least I still got oxygen. Uh, a fungal spore. I don't think that will be super helpful down here. But we might take one just for fun. Yeah, this uh, that's not good. We need to get this stuff, like, ASAP. Um... I think you'll still be fine. Yeah, got 900 calories, so that'll last a whole day.
Let me just uh, tweak the priorities a little bit, maybe. So, farming. So they do that. Need some help with streaming? Yeah, sure. No worries. Just uh, send me a message. Does this have... it's got water, yeah. Okay, I think it just looks like that because it's been sitting ready for so long. Do we have a uh, fertilizer? Not much. When they say that you need fertilizer, do they mean the resource fertilizer? I guess they do, yeah, yeah. Okay, there you go, 15,000 just like that. And they'll, they'll be able to go back. Now would have been a good time to have some some food come through the printer. How is that such a low priority? How can it possibly be that low? See, we're, we're slowly getting through it. Natural gas, still. Okay. It was low because they were doing the other things. That's fair. Stress is so high. Um, I could put like massage tables, but they won't use them unless I give them more downtime. They have phone time, so maybe I mean I'll make them. I can put in. What else could I put in? A duke bot. I wonder if they would even use it. Provides refreshments for duplicates on their break. <laughs> uh, it needs water. Meal lice? What? I get. I imagine you can choose. Strange. Fruity juice can really brighten a duplicate's break time. Eh. Ah, oh, it needs to go in like that. Nah, never mind. Never mind. Um, I could make this, but that would need like its own circuit for it. I kind of want to though. I'll um, what's on this? Uh, not that. Not that. Not that. Well, most of the things on here don't get used that much. But then again, like it's 900, so any kind of use will put it over.
Maybe I'll just turn that circuit into conductive wiring. All of it? It's a big circuit. Nah, I might have to postpone that for now. We'll go with maybe a massage table instead. Wherever they are. Where are they? This table. Where's the massage table? Ah, there you go. Stress minus 3% per minute. It uses a fair bit of power though. They do two. Okay. So that will definitely reduce stress. Hey! What? Ah, okay. Yeah, they're using two at once. That's, yeah, that'll do it. Yep. <laughs> okay. Um, let's, let's, I mean, it's only just, it's so annoying. Okay, okay. You guys do that and then you'll be happy. You'll see. Just you wait and see. Are they even working on that? Nice. That is pumping into there. Fantastic. We've got 46 units of reed fiber. Holy moly. <laughs> okay, we can probably turn that off for a little bit. And what I might do, just to help out a bit, I might send some food over. What? Even just like... Send some fried mushroom. I should have thought of that first, really. Fried mushroom. Just a little bit. Until they're not struggling. Because these will take a little bit of time to grow again. Six cycles. And in the meantime we will run out of food. You guys planning on doing that anytime soon? Yes, they are. And I could also get rid of these because we don't need them. We don't produce carbon dioxide in that way anymore. Ah, look at that. There you go. <laughs> Cool. They're hungry. It comes out here. Come on, send something guys. Send some food. Oh, I just realized they have to go in that way. 
Uh, that's a bit annoying. Gotta go all the way around to come back. Oh well, I should have built it the other way around, I guess. Doesn't matter. Wait a minute! Where does this go? Eh? Into there? Clean water? And, and do what? I haven't even set it up to do anything. It, maybe I just set that up ages ago, thinking that I would need it. Whereas, I need water more badly here, I think. I'll, yeah, I'll leave it there. It's good to know that it's there. This is still, it's not like moving down here. Maybe, this is oxygen now. I might turn that off for a bit. We kind of need it to even out, I think. Huh? Yeah. Okay. So now that there's less pressure here, the gas from here should move into this area. Should. G'day Butterbee. Long time no see. How you doing? Aha, here we go. An exosuit. Popped eardrums. Yeah, the gas pressure is insane. It goes from like less than one kilo to four, five, six kilos. That would, yeah, that would pop your eardrums. Uh, how are we going on the humanitarian effort here? Come on. Are we sending? We're sending. Okay. I think. Oh, you're sending salt. We need food. You know what? Stop the salt. Stop the salt. No pending deliveries. Squeeze me. Yeah. Okay. There you go. Fried mushroom. Just a little bit so they can eat. Because <laughs> they have no food. <laughs> it's kind of important. See some natural gas? Yeah, we like natural gas. Just like, not here though. We need it to move. Carbon dioxide. It's getting there. Like, you can see it's... It will take the place of where the oxygen was, so... Okay. We obviously need to disable this. Because they need to get through. But once that fills up... I will... Get rid of those. Deliver suits. Bang! Let's go!
Wrong element. Oi. Ah, yeah. Now it needs to come out of that one. Hold on. That's bad. Um, so it needs to go... Like that. And then a gas bridge, because there's a filter there. It's so annoying, it just goes all the way around. <laughs> Wait, is that the right filter still? Yeah, yeah it is. Yeah, yeah. I I could fix that up later as well, but for now it'll it'll work. Make that eight actually. Okay, bye-bye. They're all too busy. Oh, look at this food. <laughs> Alright, we could probably stop now. Very nice. Did we send it all? Almost. <laughs> Enjoy the food. Guys, better put it in here. I... Is this a sterile environment? It's sterile, so it's not even gonna expire there. Pogissimo. Beard cam. Did you not hear? I, I shaved my beard, yeah. I know. Uh, you gotta go eat then. Thank you. Sometimes I just, I don't know. I was just getting frustrated. It's... It can be such a pain to like keep it trimmed at a reasonable length and then like I'd, I'll i I'll put off doing it for a while and then it gets longer and then it gets harder to do and then I was just like I can't be bothered I just shaved it all <laughs> just like we'll start again it was getting um, it was a little bit itchy as well Not like, not shaved with a razor, but like, short stubble, if that makes sense. They just eat it like straight off the floor. Fair enough. Should sweep that once they're done doing whatever else they were going to do. Trim. Well, I, it's not really a trim because like when I normally trim my beard, it's like it's still a beard Like I can't run my hands through it or anything like that I just want them to finish this like they've been working on it for so long Does it look greyish? I'm not that old, come on. I don't think I have any grey hair. Or if I do, it's just like... 
maybe one here or something. Uh, is this what I want? Yeah. Okay, so that's that. Now we can get rid of this. Bang. And honestly, sometimes grey hair even looks nice on some people. I don't know if it would look like some me, but... Some people even will um, dye their hair like white or grey. It looks okay. <laughs> Not for Asian. I don't know. Maybe not, but... I was watching a TikTok of, uh, it was some, an Indian guy, and he was trying to, it was like a, a comedy skit or something, and he was trying to argue that, like, Indians aren't really seen as Asian, and... I don't know, like, you can kind of see both sides, like, obviously they are Asian, because they're in Asia. But at the same time, when you think of like an Asian person, the stereotypical view is like, uh, you know, the Eastern, like Chinese, Japanese, Korean kind of thing. So I can understand, but yeah. It's an interesting point of view. Stress is a lot lower. Is there food in the fridge? Oh, there is. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. They just get back rubs every afternoon. Doesn't sound that bad, to be honest. <laughs> Not that bad. Let me just double check how is our... Oh, they've been building this. Nice. I look away and they've done some good work on it. Because they, they don't have many other projects going. Is this... That's unreachable. Okay. Um, that should be good. That's reachable. Did they do this? They did that. So I'll snip that. So this bit here only powers that? No. No, that's that shouldn't be like that. It should be this. And then we have another circuit. Wait, what? There are two circuits here. But one here. This so confused. I should just be able to snip it like that, but I've still got two circuits here powering not much. <laughs> I can put that in there, but like, why even bother? It just does it on its own. Oh well, future proofing. Had someone from Omega. Is that still around? Oh boy. Told me I'm not really Asian. Filipino? Eh. I mean. It is Asia. Philippines is in Asia. Hmm. 
But like you could you could also say countries in like the the eastern Middle East, like you know, Afghanistan, Iraq, Iran, those kind of countries, like are they Asian? Like technically? You'd have to say yes. But also, um, you know, they they're not the stereotypical. Overloading. Overloading. How is it overloading? It's 1200. But like this is not even in use. It's not in use. You're joking me, mate. You're joking. Also, that's not connected to anything. <laughs> Maybe I will snip that off. You can be part of that circuit. Fine. Why do people think Asians are only single colored and look the same? Well, I guess it's because like, when you think of Americans, like they all kind of there is a stereotypical American look, you know, it's a stereotypical European look. I don't know. It's a good question. Algae. So does that connect? I haven't built that one. I think it's fine. Can they reach that? Yeah. Do I have Filipino friends? I think I said this before. Um, one of my best friends in, in primary school was Filipino. Very nice guy. My... One of my, my old bosses my previous work was Filipino. Also a very nice guy. There are quite a few of them around here. It wouldn't be uncommon. Filipino food. I haven't seen him for a long time now. Still very stressed. Did I not say to destroy this? Did I not say that? Cancel deconstruct, okay. And that's got to be a high priority too. Almost there. If I was to try like one... If you had to recommend one Filipino food for me to try that you think I would love, what should I try? Hard question, but what do you reckon? Hey, no gas. Awaiting rust. Okay, make the rust. Cool, I think I can enable this now. Aya.
Yeah, I made a TikTok. I, I haven't uploaded that much though. It was mainly just like funny things. Funny clips. I don't know what else to do. I need to need to think more about it. Same with Instagram. I would like to kind of grow my audience in different um, different areas, but you need to kind of make content that would work well for that area as well. More Australian content, like what? Okay, that's working well. Cool. Hi, Demon Rebuilt. I love your YouTube video. So glad I found your Twitch last week. <laughs> Thank you, Allison. Twenty-two months. Appreciate that. Thanks for watching my videos. So I would say stress is going to come down quite a bit now because they're not going to get all of this yucky lung stuff and they're not going to get eye irritation because they should all be in suits. You. Move. Casual spawn, yeah. <laughs> I was gonna make a command for like my latest video or whatever, but then I'd have to update it every time I make a new video. And who wants to do that? <laughs> All right, sending oxygen again. Hasn't paid me in 22 months. Sad. <laughs> you know, if I had enough money, like if I was making absolute bank on Twitch and had like, you know, massive audience with thousands of viewers every stream or whatever, I would absolutely be happy to pay moderators. Like I would not mind at all. I would you know, I would want to, if I've seen, I think, uh, one or two streamers that are like infinitely larger than me that pay moderators. And I think that's, that's such a cool thing. All right, we'll go for this one. How can I apply? You can't apply. I choose. Although I was thinking of maybe getting a couple new ones. We'll see. But like how cool would it be if you could earn maybe even like a part-time kind of wage. Just moderating. Because like it does take a bit of time and effort. I'd like to, but yeah, at the moment, I, I don't make that kind of money, so. Let me get rid of this as well. What is this? That's from there. Not needed. I haven't been very active in the past month. 
school has been kicking my butt. Yeah, I I figured as much. That's fine. And like Speedy's been working. Um, Kay's normally asleep at this time as well. So, I mean, I just like the idea of having a couple extra mods so that you guys don't feel bad if you have to do stuff. Like, because I, I don't expect you guys to be around all the time. I'm sure you have much more important things to do. <laughs> so yeah, that's, that's the main reason. Not like there's that much moderating that needs to be done. Grades are passing, sanity not so much. Good that you're passing at least. <laughs> Don't envy you guys at school working hard. That stress is coming down. Let's go. It's because they're all getting bloody massages. Okay, I think we've solved that issue now. So I can get rid of that. And I can get rid of this. There, let me just check if there's nothing behind here. That can all go. Look at this! Lovely oil! I wonder if we should have an automation grid so that if it's full that just stops working because we don't need it to do any more than that. They still haven't done this, you lazy bludgers. Come on. <laughs> yeah, when? When are you supplying, huh? There we go, finally gonna do it now, I think. It's been a while since I've seen them even come in here because they've been just too stressed. They come in here and they get blasted with high pressure chlorine in the face. Hey Soggy, how you doing? Thinking about making YouTube videos about me as a trans person who's Omegle. Yeah, go for it. I've seen some of those on TikTok as well. Need more trans creators. I'm all for it. Who is the most valued dupe? Hmm. That's a... I mean, I don't want to pick sides here. I don't want to pick sides. But I will say, uh, OK is the only one, the only pilot that we have. Who's, uh... Very unselfishly traveled to distant lands. So they would be pretty damn important. Bubbles does just bugger all. Are you doing some stuff, Bubbles? <laughs> Terra, I think I'm gonna make you do some more things as well. I'm sorry. <laughs> what do I want you to do? At the moment, you're just carrying stuff. Um. We don't have that many builders, but I mean everyone kind of builds stuff. 
maybe mechatronics. Wait, what do you like? You like farming. Nah, I'm not gonna give you that. <laughs> not gonna give you that. I have a lot of skill points, I know. I don't use them because they're just not necessary. Also, they just get they get too stressed if they do too many things. So I don't I don't like to give them too much. I'll just give you that. Oh, you're stressed. Oh. Why? Because you're slow, maybe. Sorry. Hey, Skive. How you doing? Been addicted to Risk of Rain 2 because new DLC. Ah, I saw the new DLC. I, I've never played Risk of Rain 1 or 2, but I've got a few Steam friends who are just all over that stuff and yeah, they were also on it as soon as that DLC came out. Alright, I'm pretty content here. I still need to think about... Like, I could send oil there. But what for? Uh, Por que? Why is that unreachable? Where are all our, our Atmo suits? Oh, they're all here. Are they? They're all there, you silly buggers. <laughs> Because of this, they need to deconstruct that one. But I was keeping that there so that they wouldn't go past it. Because then they would just jump down here. Look at the suits. Well and also good and also well. Awesome. You can change their hats. Yeah, depending on what job they have, they will use a different hat. Where are you going? Store that. Oh boy. Cook supply self or oh no. <laughs> <laughs> it's that rough. Like roguelikes? I mean, it's hard to not have some roguelikes that in your collection, but I can't say that I'm like a massive fan. Even something like Don't Starve is technically a roguelike game, isn't it? I've had no deaths, no. Not a single one. Not even really that close to having a death, to be honest. What is- is that mellow? Yeah. Because it, it looks like meat, doesn't it? Or some kind of food. But it's a seed. Sort of pizza, nice. You know, I could order something myself, maybe. Not for not for lunch though, maybe for dinner, yeah. The bad thing about games like Risk of Rain and other, I guess, other roguelikes like that is that there's, there's like no end, right? 
So... Like, you could just keep going. You need to decide what game you want to play based on... I don't know, I have, I have so many different games that I could play and I know I would like, but I don't play because I just don't have the time to play them all. Why is that supply Aaron so low? Low priority? This one is... Let's make them all nine. Because I just want to not have them going in there. And would be getting every achievement or beating the final boss. Okay. I mean, but you could say the same about games like DST. Like, there are bosses and stuff. Even a final boss. But the game doesn't end. Okay, there's one. Deliver us. Come on, man. 23! Devon. Devon. Oh yeah, this is supposed to be close. <laughs> uh, look. Quality of life update coming tomorrow. I can't see it coming tomorrow. I feel like they would have said so if it was. Not just that, but the fact that they just changed things today. Like what? I don't know. Do they, don't they need time to rejig some stuff? Yay, there's two suits. Ah. Now I don't need to mop everything, because they got suits. Speaking of suits, I was watching suits the other day, because I never finished it. I started watching it in uni, and yeah, I just never got around to finishing it. It's a pretty good show. I've been enjoying it. I'm on like season five. Playing New World, need a 30 pound fish. Is New World still still alive and kicking? I saw there was quite a bit of a, a drop off. Especially when, when people started playing, what was that other game? Uh, uh, what is it? I was even playing it. Lost Ark, that's the one, yeah, yeah. I played a little bit of that. It's okay. But it's just me on my own. I don't really have anyone to play with. Sad. Okay, that's cool. What is that? Hey! You ought to drop off a good bit, there's still a community there. Okay. You just need like a... A little bit of people, right? You don't need like a massive amount of people for it to be okay. Couple more goes of this and it'll be good, I think. And then I might turn this on so that it... It just cleans out our carbon dioxide. Yeah, so I've still got a little bit. New World has 50 player raids. Damn, that's a lot of place. <laughs> I just feel like, I don't know if any of you guys have been playing Lost Ark as well. 
But a lot of the quests were just like, speak to someone, they want you to go here, you go there, speak to someone else, then they want you to kill something, and then you go to a different place, speak to someone else, they want you to go somewhere else and kill something and come back or go talk to this person, bring something back. Just like gone from A to B to C, then then to B, then D, then back to B, then C, then D, and in between you just kill things and I don't know. It's, it's not super meaningful. The story is kind of interesting. It's a bit cliche, but it's kind of interesting. But beyond that, I just feel like I'm doing busy work to unlock more interesting. <laughs> if that makes sense. Like, why can't it all be interesting? Yo. How did that break? How did it break? What happened? Cold damage. Hey! Oh, oh, it's too cold. It's too cold, I see. Well, in that case... Boop. Oh wait, you can warm up a bit. Yeah, because now it comes out of here. It's See, I didn't think of that, because this is cool slush, it needs to sit here for a fair while to warm up. If it's less than zero, then the water that comes out of here is going to be frozen. I didn't think of that. No emotional investment in anything that has happened ever in that game. <laughs> yeah. Pretty much, yeah. Oh, we already did that. I would have liked to have seen them use that. What are these pipes? Hey. So does that not connect? Ah, come on. And same with this, does this not connect? Oh, that stinks. You're a dupe and demon would rather choose salt water over you. <laughs> If I redeem my name, are you le legally, legally obligated to get a new dupe? I would just rename one of the ones that I already have that has a, a default name. You could be Camille. This one. So I guess I need to like... Can it, it can't turn that, oh, come on. Why? Can't you turn? <laughs> Yo. It's not a U-turn, I swear. Okay, so it has to go like that. Why is that not allowed though? Mm. Is Camille better than Terra? <laughs> I've had Camille since pretty much the start, I think. Meal. Uh, wait, maybe I'll look here. Camille. Yeah. 
219. So <laughs> this Camille was printed on cycle 40. Nice. Camille loves... I like how it says this Camille. You know, like there are other ones. Loves anything that makes her feel nostalgic, including things that haven't aged well. Relatable. Very relatable. <laughs> oh, this is done. Oh, there's Camille. Yeah. slowly warming up I think because the temperature what is the temperature here six degrees it will eventually get there and how long until this turns on oh oh he's got to turn on in two cycles hell yeah hell yeah what about this 40 cycles we haven't used much I'm I'm honestly surprised at how little we've used it's good very good. What about you? Are you on now? Yeah, he's on. But we're like barely using it. We've kind of fixed our power. These are growing. Yay. Growth speed plus five. <laughs> Got rub harder, you guys. <laughs> oh, shit. That water's gone. How hot is the liquid lock of natural gas vent? Uh, 20 degrees. Nice little temperature. Because I've got this cool brine coming in and going around as well. So it won't get that hot. Stays relatively nice in here. It's lovely 35, 40 degrees. Beauty. Thanks, Allison. Yeah, we're out of water though. That's a little bit concerning. Might be worth pumping some of this back into our base. Oh, there's no way I'm going to be able to take it across that behemoth, whatever that is. Jesus. Uh... I could go all the way around. Make all three lines get one bridge at the same spot. What? How does that even work? But then how do they split again? Wait, is this... Where does that even go? It doesn't go anywhere. 
Okay. You can go in there. That's fine. I'll stick with my spaghetti for now. And I need to decide like how much do I want to put in there too. I don't want to put a huge amount. Maybe I'll I'll just toggle that manually. How are we going over here? Nice. Still haven't put this back. Oh, it's worn. Okay. What? Copper? Why did they make it out of copper? Oh, come on. I, I don't like how they replace the ones that they've already made. That's annoying. I'm gonna stop that one. I'm gonna stop you right there before you waste any more petroleum. Just running for no reason. Get out of here. Uh, this is running very low. Let's bump that up. Okay. There you go. Now I can turn that back on. So that's connected to that circuit, but ah, oh, but it needs to be connected to this too. Ah. Yeah. Otherwise, it's still going to waste some. Waiting on that for like 40 cycles. Is there sand around here? It's dirt. Nah, not really. I like coming here because they, they just get stuff done. They're very quick. Oh, they're both full. Energy saver. What does that mean? Contents of this food storage are at refrigeration. Energy saver mode has been automatically activated. Wow. That's so cool. What does that mean? Why does that turn on? Is it because it's full? Oh, that's really helpful. I mean, it, it would have been fine either way, but... Um, do we need, we need another fridge? Because the fridge is a full. Oh, there you go. Rot fell out. Yeah, it's because it was full. <laughs> Alright, we might have to move this phone. The phone over here.
colony considered to be in the late game? I don't think so. I don't think so. Definitely mid game. Oh, someone's calling. Who's calling? <laughs> Full of gossip. Wow. Adorable. Do I have a good artist over here? Mm. It's only really Catalina that does that. Devin. Devin is already stressed enough, I think. Like, their morale now is fine. Which makes me think that I can give them more skills, but then when I do... They get very stressed. So, I'll just hold off. So, did we dig much here? No. Probably need to make it a higher priority if I want that to happen. I just want to see. I want to have a look out here. What this world has to offer. Seen that. Big colony? It's getting pretty big, yeah. This is the main part of it. And then we've got this bit too. Yeah, it's, it's big, I guess. Pretty big, I guess. Uh, how are we going here? All the carbon dioxide is gone. Now, polluted oxygen can go through. Think that's all of it? No, there's still more coming out. Okay. We'll let it do its thing for a bit. How are we going with the liquid pipes? Ah, uh, yes. But see, they do it so quickly. Oh, and the, the transit tube. That's done. And they need to fix this bit, so... It needs to like... Uh, that's really annoying. It needs to cross like, here. I go, eh. God damn it. Too many things. Okay. Well, that'll be fine, I think. Wait, what? 
want. Don't deconstruct that. Where are you guys going? Too, too much. It's too much. You can't go like that. <laughs> Fuck. Come on. I could go around this way <laughs> yeah there you go wait did you break the oh you guys I think that was me that was my bad These are just the best things. I love them so much. Oh wait, do I... Will this work here? I hope they can step on that. We still have almost four tons of plastic. Is nice. Maybe I'll pump some petroleum in here. I could keep a nice well of it, use it to make plastic, and uh, use it to power some rockets too. Oh, come on, guys. Just two spots left. So, we still, we have a roughly the same amount of sucrose and roughly the same amount of sulfur as we did before, which is interesting. Okay, bye. Thanks, Doctor. P.S. If you hit the reply button instead of composing a new email, it makes it easier for people to tell what you're replying to. I appreciate it. <laughs> Try not to take it too personally. It's probably just stress. The facility started going through a major overhaul not long before you got here, so I imagine the director is having quite a time getting it all sorted out. Things will calm down once all the new departments are settled. Dr. Sklodowska. Kraus. Okay, get those data banks. I had a thought about how to solve your duplicate memory problem. Rather than attempt to access the subject's old memories, what if we were to embed all necessary information for colony survival into the printing process itself? The amount of data engineering can store has grown exponentially over the last year. Take advantage. Okay. Intriguing. So dupes don't even keep the same memories. It's just a new dupe being reprinted. Oh, that filled up. Cool. Still got a little bit of polluted oxygen in there. 600 grams. Is 
there you go it's all gone okay so this is empty or out of polluted oxygen it's still got a little bit of natural gas and I could make all of that go into here Uh Oh No 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 Oops Uh Wrong way Fuck That has to go in Here Yeah, that's the one. Okay. Yeah, there you go. Mamma mia. Only do Priax her age, her hair color. Oh, Mima. Acts more hurt when she gets hurt and is slower. Cool. Mima. Mima? Mima? I have Mima. We like Mima. So now this is all natural gas that is empty. Now we work on this one. <laughs> We're slowly getting through them all. How are we going with the water situation? Getting some come in. Good. I was getting pretty desperate there. How did the ice... did it melt? It's still there. 8 tons. 12... minus 12 degrees. Oh. They fixed it! Aha! <laughs> you gotta use it. We're gonna follow. Hell yeah. Love it. <laughs> oh, they can even go in opposite directions. Wow. Like, that'll save so much time, getting over here. Hopefully, speed up the commute time a little bit. Uh, did I snip that off? Yeah, I did. Cool. So, there's a tiny bit of chlorine. That's mainly from that. There's not much we can do about that, unless I build that down here. Which I could, but then, even then, it's still going to be chlorine here. Ah, I see. What the fuck? <laughs> Radio? Sends a green signal if above zero. Oh, above uh, was two hundred. 
so it can stay off because we've got enough. Breathability 57%. It's, it looks fine to me. Does that look like 57% to you guys? <laughs> I don't know about that. Whee! Oh, I love that. We need more of this. We need more plastic. Wait a second. I did this the wrong way. I need this to be if below, then it's on. Then we can fit more. Yes, okay, that's better. Okay, so we're getting some water. Water is coming in here. This will be on. Oh, this is turning on very soon. Okay. Nice. How, how warm are the pipes? Still very cold. That's a bit concerning. It gets warmer the, the closer it comes to here though. Not good. And because it's insulated, they're just like never gonna get warmer than that. Or it's gonna take a really long time. I could plumb them. Potentially. Stop it from uh, from freezing and then put it back in. Maybe once we start getting water in. I still claim the torch drop for DST. Oh no, sorry, that ended a long time ago. Is that there? That will be the end of our colony up there. We had the wrong thing in here. We had a tiny bit of polluted oxygen. It's coming from here. How did polluted oxygen get in here? Oh well. It's only a very, very little bit. It's fine. So that means this has run out. And now we work on this one, which is currently active. Oh yeah. And this will turn on. It will turn on before that turns off. Couldn't have timed it better. It's weird because there was a period of like 20 cycles when they were both off before, but now they're on the same. They they take turns now. I don't know. I'm not complaining. And I think I might leave it there for today. Kind of achieved all of the major things that I wanted to do for today. Colony is in a much better shape than it was when I started, that's for sure. Having moved that, that is a big, big change. They're a lot help. Like, they were all above 90, now they're all less than 10. Insane. Yeah, I'll leave it there.